Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, we're jumping right back into the fray, uh, rescuing Hyrule and and our old buddy Link, right? If you saw last episode, you know that we found some flying tiles in the dungeon. Uh, and I think this chick wanted them. Travels, have you ever seen the tiles that can fly through the air? Why, yes, I have. You mean like that? Did I just blow your mind? Is this the flying tile that Facet spoke about? You've got to show that to me again. Show it to me a bunch. All right. Now that I've seen the tiles with my own eyes, I can share what I learned with my boss. Thank you. You've been a huge help. Please take this as payment for your assistance. 50 bucks? $50. I mean, it seems a little low. I had to go find that tile in a dungeon that was crawling with monsters and it was in basically a sand pit. But no, 50 bucks should just about cover it. Uh, I need something to wet my whistle. Let me see. Eggs and grapes doesn't sound like a great combo. Uh, milk and eggs. That kind of works, right? A little bit. Making a cake or something. Let's do it. Your smoothie. That one looks pretty good. You got a golden smoothie. I got a golden smoothie. I got a golden twinkle in my eye. Uh, let's see. Ah, ah, oh shit. Ah, ooh. Let me get out of here. This is Lake Kylia, huh? Oh, we found a fairy fountain. Is she going to be hot or is she going to be hideous? She's adorable. Oh, are you the one that woke me up, dear? Let's have a look at you. Yes, I don't know who you are or where you're from, but you are a diamond in the rough. And with just a bit of polish, you could be a diamond with the stuff. But what approach to take? Hmm. I've got it. What if I increase the number of accessories you can wear? Yes, we must be bold, daring. Are you ready to begin your adventure of style? Make me more stylish. Teehee, how can I refuse your most heartfelt wish to be more stylish? But I won't insult you by doing it for free, of course. The trouble with the free service is you're always waiting for the bill. Hmm. I don't believe in waiting, so I always collect my fees in advance. Of course, I'll need 100 rupees. Okay. How I adore rupees. Um, as promised, I will enhance your style. Lay it on me. Your accessory limit has been raised by one. You can now wear more accessories than ever before. Now go out into the world and show off your accessory success. A uh, quick question. What the fuck are accessories? All right. Then we got it. Then we got it. I think we got it. I think we got it. Ugh. All right, I think we're here. What's this? Doing this will recover hearts and energy. Very effective, but kind of bitter. I don't think I have a bottle for it. 
Oh, I guess I don't need a spare bottle for it. Soldiers came here looking for that princess. What's her name? I guess she escaped him. <laughs> Wonder if I'd get a reward if I turned her in. Stab him, Zelda. This guy's a fucking snitch. That son of mine, always doing things his own way, isn't he? Oh, didn't mean to grumble that loudly. My son, Anube, hasn't come home in a while. That boy's surely sleeping in the woods to the north again. Why would I bother making him a meal? Well, if you're headed that way, could you take some grilled fish to him? I'll get it for you. Wait right here. Yeah. Sorry, I know it's a lot to carry to him. I really wish he didn't make us all go to this trouble. Oh, almost forgot to tell you something really important. There have been hungry monsters lately in the woods where he naps. Watch out. Just let me know if that grilled fish goes bad. Thanks for delivering it. You learned the grilled fish echo. All right, they can go this way. Give me their crows. All right, just like that. That's the giant rift that I spotted earlier. Let's investigate. Ah. Uh. I can make the rift entrance back there. Let's go farther inside, Zelda. Uh. Oh yeah, looks like this place got swallowed up bad by the rift. Hmm? Hold on, who's this? We're about to get captured. Uh. I bet you came here because you're worried about Lord Jabu Jabu, huh? Uh. I know we are. He's been running wild all over the place since his rift spread. This rift spread in his den. Yeah, we got here fast as we could to see what's going on with him. Huh? You want to get in his den? To open the door, the chiefs of the river clan and the sea clan must play music here together. If you want the chiefs to play music here, you'll have to go to each village and ask him. All right, so we got to go to both the Zora chiefs and get them to squash their feud. Uh, oh, whoa. What's another smoothie shop guy? Ah, uh, I really stepped in it this time. I don't have what I need to open shop. Oh, you a customer? While I'm grateful you dropped by, the smoothie shop isn't open yet. See, I ran out of bubble kelp because, well, it doesn't matter why. He ate him. I de he definitely ate him. I'm not sure what to do. It only grows in the sea, and seawater doesn't agree with me. I don't suppose you've got three pieces of bubble kelp you could part with. Uh, do I have them? Oh, thanks much. Hang on, you don't have three pieces of bubble kelp. Why'd you lie? I thought I did. Uh, it was an honest mistake. How many pieces do I have? Uh, bubble kelp. Bubble kelp. Bubble kelp. Where? I only have two. Ah. All right, let's go find some. Uh. Mm. This guy had some. All right, here you go. Here you go. Bubba bubba bubble kelp. I can't thank you enough. You saved my bark. I've learned my lesson. That's the last time I snack on ingredients. I knew it. I knew this guy ate him. Now, I'm pleased to announce that the Zora Cove smoothie shop is open for business. Thank you and celebrate the big day. Here's this. It's five bucks. Okay, 20 bucks. I'm about to say. 
but 20 bucks still doesn't seem like enough like figuratively speaking i taught that man to fish instead of just giving him a fish right i gave him a means to provide for himself and make a wage make a living wage all right what's up Hylian, I'm impressed you were able to swim all the way out here. Do you have business in our village? If so, you'll find the entrance down there. All right. Mm. Welcome to Caesar Village, our underwater paradise. New to the Jabul Waters area? We're the Caesar, the Zora that make our home out here in the waves. Chief Kushra, Kushara and the River Zora Chief are having a big tiff. It's going on forever. The longer they squabble, the harder it'll be for them to make up. All right. Anybody have any valuable information? All Zora everywhere love music. And so does the great spirit, Lord Jabu Jabu. I'm sure that's key information. That's why we in the River Clan get together to offer our music to Lord Jabu Jabu. But right now he's behaving so wildly that it'd be difficult to stage a performance for him. This is a grave situation. First, that rift. Now, Lord Jabu Jabu going wild. Lord Jabu Jabu is the spirit of all Zora, but it falls to us to call him him. This crisis is without equal. And now it's time that I, Kushara of the Caesar, resolve it. Chief, what inspiring words. Please, tell me how you plan to do it. Lord Jabu Jabu loves our sea music, so I need only get him to listen to us perform. And then Drad, that tuneless buffoon, will have to applaud my performance. I take it that you haven't resolved your latest quarrel with the other chief yet? And why would I? This quarrel is one for the ages. I will never speak to him again. He insulted my music. I will not tolerate his presence. It's like he lives to provoke me. Oh, he'd be fine if he agreed that I was more talented. Never mind all that. We have to leave immediately, Rogma. Oh, greetings, Eileen. I'm on my way out. Your business will need to wait. All right. Did you have a request for our chief? I'm sorry to say that until she's resolved our problems, she won't have time to help. If our great crisis wasn't bad enough, our chief is quarreling with the rivers or our chief. They often have their little quarrels, but always make up quickly. Not this time. What's the saying? A squabble a day keeps a friendship in play? Such nonsense. Well, stranger, I shouldn't burden you with our troubles. Hi. Ragma, please. We must be off to Crossflow's Plaza. Oh. Yes, at once. Hmm. If you'll excuse me. Squabble? What a strange word. I don't understand what it means. But I do know that we'll never reach that rift until the two chiefs hear out our request. Oh. Welcome to the River Zora Village, where friendly hellos and good times flow. At least, uh, normally. Lord Jabu Jabu's gone berserk. Now we're all just scared. Okay. These guys seem more like the Larrys to the uh, the Ocean Zoras, like Nigels, if that makes sense. Right? Like these guys are like herbs. Where is the chief? Is it? There we go. Our people are scared, boss. 
That huge ripped opening. Lord Jabu Jabu on the rampage. Fear not. I have a plan. When have I, the great Drad, ever let you down? First, I'll get Lord Jabu Jabu nice and relaxed again. I'm thinking Handy J. Good thinking, boss. But how will you do that? I just said it, Handy J. With music, of course. River music. That'll stop his rampage. We're just that good. Then that no talent Kashara will finally bow down to my superior skills. Heh. <laughs> Hold on, boss. Hold on, boss. Why are you still squabbling with the Sea Zora chief? You two usually make up right away. It's really dragging on this time. Squabbling? This is a big deal. She mocked my music. I'll never make up with her. Bah. I'm not going to just sit around. I've got real problems to deal with, you know what? One of them is clearly a clone, or both of them. They're a Rift clone. Who are you? Huh? Doesn't matter. It's gotta wait. Did you need our chief for something? Sorry, Dread is busy. The boss has a lot going on right now. Doesn't help that he's having his worst squabble ever with the Sea Zora chief. Their fights are usually small, then just fizzle out. This time, it's blown up completely. They used to get along so well, too. Yeah, this fight's gotten really bad. Inawa, what's the holdup? We've got to get to Crossflow's Plaza. Hi. Come in. Ah. Sorry, the boss calls. See ya. Alright, Crossflow's Plaza. Then I guess it's time we join the two chiefs there as well. All right, let's see. All right, this kid should be over here. Um, where's my snack? Uh, where's that grilled fish? Where is it? Where is it? Here we go. Hmm, smells good, but not like mom's. Dude, do I have to carry that guy's fucking... I have to carry that shit all the way from over here. Okay. Right there, I'll get you another one. My son should be in the woods north of here. So I gotta carry this one. This specific one. All the way to the woods. And I probably have to be snappy about it. Mm. All right, come on. Shit. Uh. Uh. Wait, where is uh? Shit. Hmm. Get him. Yep. Hit. <laughs> ah. Three dead's a powerhouse. All right, come on. What is that? Ten river horses. What do they do? These creatures have distinctive mouths. You can't use them in their current form. Uh, there. There we go. Yum. Something smells amazing. My mom's grilled fish. She came all this way to bring it to me? Thanks. I'm starving. Time to dig in. Crispy, salty, juicy, perfect in every way. This grilled fish is the best. So is my mom. 
Delicious. My tummy is satisfied. Tell my mom thanks. I'm going to get in a nice post-meal nap here. All right. Uh, let's go. See what's up with this kid's mom. Maybe she has something for me. What's up, boo? Did you deliver that grilled fish to my son? Thank you so much. Huh? You went back to sleep after eating it? That boy. I swear he spends the entire day just sleeping or eating. Ah, uh, sorry. Just thinking out loud again. I'll get you a reward for your hard work. I'm grateful for your help. Please take this. You got 10 pieces of bubble kelp. I'll leave some grilled fish here too. Take as much as you want. Okay. How dare you? You shouldn't have come here. I'll take care of Lord Jabu Jabu myself. Get lost. My thoughts precisely. Off with you. Grumble, grumble. <laughs> I know it should probably be my motherfucker. Hey, Kashara, you can stuff your plan. We of the Caesar will bring calm to Lord Jabu Jabu. Our music can quiet his rage. Ridiculous. We'll do it, not you. Yikes, they're at it again. It was only a matter of time before these two exploded. But not here, not now. The way you play, you just enrage him more with your crude honking. So we'll play. Insults. Always insults. It says more about your music than mine. But sure, let's do this. Your playing is weak. It's puny. It won't have any effect. What? Now you've done it. There are some things you can't take back, you know. Uh. It's time we settle this. One last performance to see who's playing is superior. No problem. On the count of three, we both play. The best player wins. What? Perform together in this state? My chief, with all due respect, you can't hope to put on a great performance this way. It's no use. There's no stopping them when they get like this. Where the fuck was he keeping that? Uh, okay. They both have access to hammer space. I like this. Uh. That was terrible. They didn't play in time with each other. Not at all. It just pissed Jabu Jabu off even more. <laughs> Lord Jabu Jabu. Aww. You came here when you heard my performance, didn't you? How did you like it? Ha, there's no question that my playing was what brought him here. Shut up already. Guys, guys. Guys, you both suck. Huh? The boss, watch out. Is he gonna fucking swallow them both up? Chief Kashara, get back. Their assistants get swallowed. Oh. <laughs> All right, we just witnessed a murder. How can this be? Gulp down. The both of them. There's no time to delay. I'll go in pursuit of Lord Jabu Jabu and rescue Ragma. No fair. No head starts. Our friends are in danger. Forget this talk of head starts. Me first. Hey, you cheater. I love that both the Zoras are in this game. This is getting out of control, and we still haven't been able to ask them what we need. They've got to open that door in the den for us. 
But that'll never happen at this rate. What a mess. Lord Jabu Jabu went upriver. Do you think he's heading towards your village? I bet you're right. Oh no, I've got a bad feeling about this. Yeah, I like the... I like that they finally kind of addressed uh, that there have been two different types of Zoras uh, in across the Zelda games, you know? Because I remember the that more toady looking ones being in like uh, Link to the Past and the more sleek ones like light blue ones looking uh, being in like uh, Ocarina of Time and also I think they were the ones most recently in like Breath of the Wild right let me see where are my crows where are my crows at Okay. Ah, ah. Boss. Was that the River Zora chief? It came from over there. Way over this way. This way to go. Turns up that waterfall. I think I also heard someone yell over there. This is really bad. Ah, uh, my papa and Drad. It's all right. I'm here to help. We'll find your father and the chief. Something awful has happened here. Hmm. The Hylene. Hello again. Chief Drad and I followed behind Lord Jabu Jabu as he rampaged through here. Lord Jabu Jabu wasn't himself. He struck my poor papa who who fell into the rift. That's when Chief Drad and I got here only to see the rift suddenly grow. Drad saved this child from being caught but was then swallowed up himself. Can't say where Lord Jabu Jabu has gone but Drad oh it's all too terrible. All right. Into the bear pit. I can create an entrance here. Stand back, Zelda. All right. I can sense my friends here. They're trapped. They're trapped in five areas to be exact. Oh, there goes some of them. Wow, this makes it way easier. All right. There's one. Nope. Oh. All right, two. Who's in here? Anybody? Okay, okay, okay. What's that? 
How do I get over there? All right, three. Mm. Gotcha. What is it? Beery Echo. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Jeez. All right. Uh. Sit on that, asshole. No. No. Go down. Go down. Go down. Go down. Ah. All right. I need to get some rest real quick. Get some shed eye. One more. Hmm. There we go. That Lord Jabu Jabu or Lord Drag or what was his name? There he is. He'll go back to normal, just like the others, if we can fix this rift. We found all of my friends in this area. Now we can mend this rift. Roll call. My friend shared some of their power with me. Let's go. We got two my crystals from Try. Zelda, let's go back to your world now. I'm sure there's still some more work to do with Lord Jabu Jabu. I'll probably still have to like Go inside of his belly and rescue some people. Oh, never mind. Well, let's see. Hmph. Me, of all Zora, swallowed up by a rift. My goodness, Drad. Don't be so... Don't be so precious. Now, thank this Hylian. Who's calling who precious? You with your frilly gills. Ah. Just make out already, jeez. Fuck or don't. Boss Drad, what's wrong with my papa? Caught in that darkness, swallowed whole. Can't breathe. Uh, uh. Hey, what's wrong with you? Uh, it's like he's stuck back in there. Then I will unstick him. Did that help? I'm... I'm... I'm okay now. Thanks to you. Ah, well, the music of the Caesar lures frantic thoughts into a deep calm. Oh. That performance. Good as it gets. Chief Kashar. Chief Kashar. What's the matter? It's Lord Jabu Jabu. He's in Zora Cove. Huh? Right then, let's go. Hey, wait for me. 
Oh, almost forgot about you. Kashara said you saved us. Who are you anyway? Zelda, huh? I know I've heard that name. Well, Zelda, I owe you a big thanks, but that's gotta wait. I need to catch up with Kashara. I owe her big time too. See you around. There they go again. That music she played was pretty nice. She performs better by herself. All right. Seems like we got one half of this situation solved. Uh, we're going to have to wrap it up for this episode and get to the next leg of this adventure uh, next time. I appreciate you hanging out with me as always. Um, yeah, leave me a like. It really helps out our, our little channel here and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.